Okay, last song for today. I've actually seen this uh, video pop up quite a few times. Um, yeah, once again, I'm curious. <laughs> and I have, I have heard the name Lorna Shore before. I swear I have. I assume it's this band. I don't know, <laughs> but I'm like, you know what? I wanna, I wanna see what it's about. So, um, I'm coming into this like totally blind. I do not know what to expect at all. Um, it looks like it could be like rock or metal or something just from the the thumbnail that I saw, but you never know. So, um, you can skip the lyric review. Shouldn't be too long. And you know me, I like slaughter lyrics, so <laughs> I do apologize. And I'm reading through that, I'm like, it just sounds, I mean, it's to the hellfire, which actually, I thought it was interesting when I was looking up some things, it actually came up with the um, Hunchback of Notre Dame, or Notre Dame, I always not say Notre Dame because of the football, but Notre Dame, it was talking about the, um, it was the priest. What was his name? Let me see if I can find that. I'm like, I wonder if that is um, to the Hellfire. Is that the name of the? No, it's just called Hellfire. Uh huh. So I was like, oh, that's interesting. So maybe not, because it was just called Hellfire. But anyway, sorry. Um, so I was reading. I've been reading a lot of different um, opinions about what the lyrics mean, and one of the things that comes up is basically um, death, like what it feels to be like on the brink of death. Um, one interesting person that I read um, was talking about that they had tried to commit suicide at one point, um, and they remember this darkness that they were in and thinking, okay, this is it, I'm gonna die. Um, they said they felt those pins and needles right here, um, the trapped sensation, um, and I heard Az Azrael was the... So I think they said he takes souls to the underworld, if I remember correctly. <laughs> See, my final breath. Swallowed by the womb of death. Face this damnation. Like you're facing, you're facing death. Um. Unfortunately, you're not going to a very good place. <laughs> yeah, so I guess maybe describing what it's going to be like when you're dying and you haven't been a good person and you're going somewhere you shouldn't be going. And I don't know. But anyway, that was, that's all the stuff that I kind of looked up and I'm like, okay, well it does, I mean, it sounds like it really matches with the lyrics, so we'll go with that. <laughs> if I'm totally wrong, you can tell me. You usually do, so. Uh, 20, oh look, Deathcore Metal. Interesting. I still have no idea what I'm getting into. <laughs> um, let's try it. Lorna Shore. It sounds like Irish or something. I'm gonna have to look up where they're from. Okay, I'm kind of nervous actually. <laughs> okay, let's do this.
Okay, weird. If I would not have been watching this music video, I wouldn't have known that was a person. It, it sounds almost... Mm, I used to okay, the, play the cello and whenever we'd mess with the strings, you'd put your nails up and down like... Ree! On the, I'm like, that's what it kind of... and it's like distort... Yeah. I would not have known that was a person. And I've never... In all the music that I've heard, even on this channel, I've never heard anything like that. Oh, hey. My threat is secured. Thank you. Okay. Let's keep going. Sorry. I'm really trying to concentrate. I was like, wait, has the has the song started? Like, is he actually saying lyrics or is he just, just making noise kind of like a, what do you call that, disturbed? You know, he makes all those little no noises that are, <laughs> I love those. No, but then I heard pins and needles and I was like, okay, okay. So he's actually, like, I can't understand a thing he's saying, but I mean, it, it, it sounds like a bunch of demons devils, goblins, just all, like, just, well, it sounds like you're going to the hellfire, but I will definitely give it that. <laughs> um, this is really interesting. It's not like any deathcore, metalcore I've heard so far. Um, Gosh, like, I, I, I don't even have anything to compare it to, which is interesting because <laughs> when I first started this journey, I would have said all of it sounds the same. Um, but maybe I, I've been listening to it long enough now that I'm actually um, learning to, like, differentiate. Like, I can tell a difference in the music, I can tell a difference um, in the drumming, I can tell a difference in the voice. Like, it's very unique um, from what I've heard so far. So, ooh, six minute song. Let's get going. <laughs> high scream? I mean, so way up there. Usually whenever I listen to stuff where guys are growling, it's just that lower stuff. I never, you never hear like a scream like that. That is so interesting to me. Um, and all these really um, different, what do you call them, uh, tempo changes, just the drum, like it'll be like consistent and awesome. It'll like change the tempo and then tempo, I'm like, whoa, where's it going? And it's, yeah, there's a lot to take in for this song. Um, I'm really trying to, and I can actually pick out some of the the lyrics here too, so, okay, we're about almost halfway through, let's see.
crazy. was a nice guitar solo. Got another shredder in the house, y'all. And how the heck do they drum so fast? Like, is the drum, I've heard of a kick drum. I'm like, do they have like a double time, like where you push the pedal and it kind of like, like hits twice or maybe two or three times with each press or something? Or is it just your foot's going a thousand miles an hour or you, or there's more than one and you're like, one, two, three, four, five, <laughs> I'm like, how do you drum that fast? Okay, anyway, sorry. Um, I love these little areas where they stop. It's just, I'm like, in my mind, I'm watching like bombs go off. I'm like, boom. <laughs> it's just, so it's very amusing. I love it. Just like that. was like, oh my god, that was demonic. Now if they ever make any more like demon movies, they need to get this guy to do the the uh, sound effects for it and the voice for it. Yeah. Wow. I am like, <laughs> I am in shock. Um, so like I say with most like metalcore, deathcore type of stuff. It's not something I would put on my iPod, but I've got to say, this is like the most fun I've had <laughs> listening to this kind of music um, ever. Like, I'm going to have to watch this again. I'm going to have to watch everybody else's reactions to it. Um, that was just awesome. <laughs> um, I really loved that, actually. Um, that was so different. Gosh, I've never heard something like that. Um, so anyway, and, and they look really young. So I'm like, I know I've heard the name Lorna Shore, but where have I heard it? Because they look really young. Have they, are they older than they look and they've been around for a long time? So then, and that's where I've heard that? Or is, is that something else like is that a name of something else i should know i don't it's, it's gonna bug me i'm gonna have to look it up because i'm like i know that name i know it but anyway <laughs> that was fun that was so fun oh my gosh okay so that was lorna shore to the hellfire that was interesting not at all what i was expecting at all and what's that okay um, so I think I said everything I needed to say in there. Um, it was just, it was very complicated, very complicated, very intricate there. That might be a better word, a very intricate song. Just so many parts to it, so many elements to it, and uh, yikes. So, um, anyway, comment and like and subscribe. <laughs> um, 16 minutes, oh wait, it was a six minute song though, so, um, come and see me on my social media, 
Can I say hello? Please, 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 please send a postcard or like a little souvenir from where you live. I love stuff like that. Um, and my challenge has not been accepted yet. Mm, a little sad. Um, I say the first three, maybe four postcards or whatever letters, whatever, that are sent get to have their request immediately um, within the first two weeks. Um, and I get notified when things are sent um, once it's in the system so I know who will send stuff first. So even if you're um, in another country and you're like, okay, mine will never get there fast enough, then don't worry. Because the second it's in the system, it tells me, yeah, you got something on the way. And um, so I will know who sent something first. Um, as for the rest of the songs, especially the ones that I just found, I had this whole list from when I first started. I'm going to put them into a random genu blah, blah, generator. I don't say generator. Okay, random generator. And we're gonna. I'm gonna do that at least once a week. Um, just randomly generate what I'm gonna react to. I will say a lot of them at this point are Avenged Sevenfold because when I reacted to a couple of those songs, like the requests were endless, so that I have a lot of those. Um, but anyway, that's all I got for this one. So I'll see everybody next time. <laughs>